Welcome back to AMN, I am your host RJ West and today I am going over the NBA 2K18 realistic sliders that I use and so this is with my Utah Jazz test my league when I used to test sliders and yeah shout out to that Michigan fan on Operation Sports because he's who I use for NBA 2K whenever I need some sliders so make sure to check him out on Operation Sports and so when we go over the my league sliders first the main thing that I wanted to see happen is not too crazy of simulation, not too crazy simulation results, and yeah, I mean, that's basically the main thing. There's some things jacked up for morale and for um, team chemistry, but that's basically just to make things difficult and not make it seem so easy because it's not as easy team chemistry takes some time to get used to each other and so yeah there's that for the my league sliders and for the gameplay sliders the only thing that I'm probably gonna change that what you're looking at in this video is the ball security I'm gonna turn that up to 45 or 50 because there are too many loose balls and so I want to make sure to limit that and make sure that there aren't as many loose balls and steals and stuff and so you can see that the CPU defense is what is being improved the on-ball defense pretty much because the lateral quickness is up to 75 and the on-ball defense is up to 80 just so there aren't as much easy scoring opportunities especially when it comes to the Warriors because right now I have Steph Curry and Kevin Durant in my Warriors my league of course I mean we all know that but those two guys can do really well against other defenders on ball and they can really create their own shots so yeah I mean just looking to make sure that there's common grounds and then you see the tendencies it's basically at 50 for the user because we control all the tendencies and all that whenever we play and the rebounding is down a little bit because it, it just seemed like super easy I mean I, I'm not sure exactly why the reason that is but it gives me realistic results so that's all I really care about Steel success is down, but ball security, I'm going to need to turn that up because I just don't feel like there should be as many loose balls. I already said that. And you see the there's pretty common grounds when it comes to shooting, like mid-range shooting and layup success and three-point shooting because there's nothing too crazy, nothing too crazy bad, nothing too crazily good. So yeah, common grounds right there. I played the first game of my Warriors My League, so I got pretty solid results. And I will continue to use these sliders, just less just ball security will help that. And so to find these sliders, the My League sliders is going to be if you search up my online ID, Mr. A Miles1, you'll find RJ West My League sliders, or just RJ West My League. I'm pretty sure it's just RJ West My League. Yes, it's RJ West My League. So you'll find that if you turn up if you search up Mr. A Miles1, and then you will find my sliders, my gameplay sliders that I use. If you search up my online ID again, it'll be under RJ West sliders. Just this time, that's basically all that's different, but it's in different sort of, it's in different categories. So yeah, you should be able to find both of them if you want to use these. And yeah, the only thing that I'm gonna do at the time of recording this is turning up ball security up to 45, up to 50. And that's really the only thing that I found to be a problem with these sliders, just too many loose balls. So yeah, we'll get into this gameplay a little bit just to see, just to show you what happens. It'll be the Jazz going up against the Rockets. This is year three, I'm pretty sure, of this My League. And you see James Harden getting open and knocking down the three. He's got some range and he got some room. So nice results right there and then you'll see I have Colin Sexton and Donovan Mitchell is out for the rest of the season but I ended up picking Jason Tatum up from the Celtics since they have plenty of small fours and he was expendable so I got Jason Tatum and I got pretty nice power fours I have a nice team right here I have a nice power forward Yabusel he developed pretty nicely and I have Jaron Jackson at center and at shooting guard I have Karis Levert so we have a decent team built upon shooting and just being a run and gun type of offense. Seven seconds or less, I'm pretty sure is what, no, it's a perimeter centric system proficiency is what I used for this Jazz team. And so you see James Harden working him, but can't connect on that shot. And so the rebound goes to Sexton, outlet goes to Jaron Jackson, 
and up top to Yabusel on the right elbow down low to Sexton looking for Yabusel picked off by Ryan Anderson outlet goes to Dylan Brooks stopping popping and can't connect but you see Clint Capella on the rebound and on the follow throwing it down so yeah I mean it's Clint Capella he averaged nine rebounds a game last year so he's a pretty good rebounder and getting to work right there then you see a couple hands offs goes to Sexton can't connect on that jump shot bad shot by Colin Sexton and you see I just didn't take as many good shots in this game and so James Harden finding Chris Paul splash so yeah I mean I wasn't on my best in this game so this wasn't the best sample but I just wanted to get you guys some gameplay just to show you guys what happens because we're the eighth seed also and the Rockets are the number one seed so yeah clear difference from these two teams we're not on their level per se I feel like we could put up a decent fight if I tried better but I mean this is the better team and so yeah Dylan Brooks I, I there aren't as many loose balls in this sample in this gameplay sample but in other gameplays that I've played there were a couple more loose balls so I'll probably just turn it up to 45 and you see James Harden can't connect in and out rebound goes to Tatum so yeah I'm still gonna turn it up to 45 but yeah and you see zero points in two minutes and ten seconds and so the Rockets can connect right there rebound goes to Paul or Paul gets the outlet out to Brooks on the right wing finds Harden wide open on the baseline mid-range money timeout jazz and that's it so yeah those are my realistic sliders if you want to get them again I will put that on the screen probably since the gameplay ended and so I have been RJ West and I'm saying so long <laughs>